Now, speaking of pettiness and uh, and truth telling, bro, like, I, have y'all heard the Drake album yet? Hey, you know what? I, st I still haven't listened to it, but it been so much commentary on this shit. It making me not want to hear it. I've, I've listened to it. You a Drake fan, Trey? I'm, 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 I'm a Drake fan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Trey, yeah, Trey, you I'm, a Drake I'm, fan? I'm a, I'm a Drake fan too. I was listening to it the first time I listened to it, but I had already saw a lot of the comments, you know, mm -hmm. from mainly from our group chat. And so, like, I'm listening to it, and I'm like, oh, this, this all right. But what it was is the mood I was in when I started listening to it. You know what I mean? I went back and started listening to it that same day. And I'm like, this shit is horrible. Like, like it really was bad. But then it, and then it hits, like, a point in the album, because it's, like, 23 or 24 songs on there, where it's, like, a... It's a it's a little vibe music on there, you know what I mean. But it's it's not like a, it's it's nothing that I'm you know I'm I'm gonna listen to it a few more times where I can find a couple of tracks I like off there, throw them in some playlists, and I'm done with that album. Yeah, and you, and you said have, <clears throat> yeah, go ahead. No, I was about to ask Blaze, but because I thought you was done making your point, go ahead. No, yeah, the first half of that album, like the 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 production is just it's not there. It all like he had some songs where it almost sounded like some he was trying to do a Kanye type of sound. You know what I mean? Like it, it just it is it wasn't a Drake album that I'm used to whatsoever. Yeah, man. I'm I'm I, I, it, it seems like people been saying that, but uh leaving out the him and twenty one album, like the last what, two, three albums for Drake been like not taken well. I haven't liked anything besides her loss since Scorpion. Any solo Drake uh, props since Scorpion, like it, I don't like all that damn singing and slow, slow <laughs> rapping and singing and shit. That irritates me, child. I'm sorry. That you sound, you, sound like you sound like Kendall. Kendall hate that shit. Kendall hate that shit. Like, yeah. It really does. It, it, it's like cringy. It it vibe, Kendall said he don't want to hear that singing. <laughs> hey, <laughs> no, hey, 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 it, yeah, it, it be a vibe though, man. Like, like it just it, it, depends, it be. It, oh. it just depends on what mode you in. Like, you know, like I'm, I'm, I like to travel like a lot. Like I be, we be on beaches and shit. I be wanting to hear that Jamaican, you know what I'm saying? Like I be mm. vibing to a lot of that Drake shit. But like you just riding in the car, he ain't gave you nothing in a long time. You know what I'm saying? Like just he done had a, he, I mean he's had a couple songs that were good, but as far as album wise, though, and I'm a Drake fan too, so like yeah. he got I, a couple tracks on this this album, but it, it just ain't. It's not a good album though. Yeah, I I consider myself a fair critic. I tell people all the time I don't compare Drake. To Kendrick, Cole, none of them. Like I don't, I don't compare Jay to Nas. I've never been that way. I've all, if I like an artist, I like I'm coming to you for a certain sound, a certain vibe, whatever. I don't mind nobody being experimental. I don't mind like like Kendrick went from Good Kid, Mad City to Pimple Butterfly. I love to Pimple Butterfly. That that album wasn't wi widely received as well as Good Kid, Mad City, but it's a phenomenal album. Like and he was being experimental. He was more in his artist bag. I didn't judge him from jumping from. Good Kid, Mad City into uh, uh, into to Pimp Butterfly. I don't never judge artists when they do that. When Drake did his his dance album, being experimental with his sound, I didn't I didn't uh, judge him for that. I I didn't even look at that in, in the cat same category as Drake's quote unquote hip hop albums. You know what I mean? I'm like he trying something. So I know he wants this shit to be played in the Biza, Busan, like you know what I'm saying all, all that type of shit. Turks and Caicos. He want that. He's trying to set that vibe. So I don't really judge him for that. I, I but what I am going to compare you to is your past works. Like like. Kendrick went from Good Kid, Mad City to Pimple Butterfly, phenomenal album, to Damn, phenomenal album, to Mr. Morale and the Big Steppers. And Mr. Morale and the Big Steppers, uh, was it Lil Steppers? Big Steppers, whatever it is. Big, big, Steppers. big Steppers, yeah. Mr. Mr. Morale, I don't even think that was widely received because the subject matter is so heavy on that album. You know what I mean? But the album showed his growth. It showed it was it was extremely introspective. And if you would have told me from Good Kid, Mad City to now and Drake's album around that same time that drake would be that that kendrick would be more introspective and would have grown to this point that he is at now and drake would be where he is right now i wouldn't have believed you you know what and i mean I, and i and i think that's the thing that's, that's standing out to me with when you come to kendrick drake and cole like you can see the growth with kendrick and cole or mm -hmm. it's like drake I, yesterday i told you i said drake going through a midlife crisis right it just seemed like he I don't know what it's, I don't know what he doing, man. He doing weird shit all the time. He, I don't know, man. It's yeah, just, Brett, Brett. And he's also yeah, yeah. an actor though. Like he's a whole ass actor, so he might be just playing the fucking role and just trolling his whole life because he's an mm -hmm. asshole. But like he's an actor, mm -hmm. so you really 
don't know what he on for real for real like he's not really a rapper but, or whatever that shit is like he's a whole fucking disney actor ass nigga yeah. <laughs> like that, i mean seriously. i mean i mean, I mean he, came, he came from that but i don't think we can like just always lump him in is that you know what i'm saying no, like, no, no she got she got he, she got a point because no, I mean, she's she speak, she's speaking something more about his character because because yeah. like i said because right. yeah, yeah. no, all no, the no, absolutely I agree, I agree with that for sure. yeah, yeah all the marketing around this album i hate like like he he named this album for the dogs i thought this was gonna be some hard shit then the first single come out, he come out with the song with SZA. And that song was mid as fuck. The only part of that song I like is SZA, SZA uh, verse. Like, she killed it. Um, but but I don't know what Drake was doing on that song. You know what I mean? So, like they, like I said, he teased that he wanted the, the album cover to be, um, what's her name? Holly Berry getting Holly uh, Berry. yeah getting yeah. slime. That was what he wanted. She said, well, no, we're not going to use that. So, he said, we're going to do the joint with my son, with the, the dog that my son drew or whatever. Okay, cool. So, then he goes from that. To wearing barrettes in his hair, uh, uh, then he's doing the the weird shit with the clips and the and the grill. I'm just like, fam, what are you doing? Man, like, like, yeah, like like Blake said, man, like he's just out here doing shit. And the first thing I heard, yeah, yeah. W- w- first thing I felt when this album came on is like, oh, this ain't for me. This is definitely for some kids. When I heard that, when like the first two songs in, yeah. I, I felt like that song was that album. I, was for some kids. I was just about to say that though, like you know, like the the, the times keep changing. You know what I'm saying? Like every mm-hmm. year. And I feel like he he going too deep into it with like these young artists coming out and like what the kids like, fam. You 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 solidify. You can really make your genuine music and people gonna buy it. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. You don't have to really try to be so much like these kids coming up. He just trying to stay relevant when you are you you are relevance itself. Fam. Mm-hmm. It don't matter. You don't you don't hit a pinnacle. You don't have to do that bullshit. But it's a lot of that in this album though. Absolutely, where you just like, oh, this is a kid. Like this, this was some young, some little young punks or something. You know what I'm saying? Like who trying to vibe or something like that. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 no, I, I agree. I, I was and and especially. So uh, let me let me say I, I wouldn't expect this album to sound the way it did with him working with Yachty because Yachty's last project was experimental and it was good music. Like that, like that, that was a good project. That was a good project. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And then he released the, even the, even the the single that Yachty got with J Cole. Like 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 I know Yachty did a lot of writing and probably Sheesh. producing on this shit. And I think uh, KD executive produced the album, but uh, Kevin Durant. But I'm like bro, I'm it's it's just bad, bro. This album is absolutely yeah. basuda. Like, like I even chill for Birdman. Be at y'all dog. Like he can, Bird Man can do whatever the hell he wants to. <laughs> you better, you but, better chill for he flame you like he did Joe Budden. Hey, yeah, yeah. But hey, Bird Man ready to whoop anybody ass that got beef with. But I, but, but 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 okay, but 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 he ready, he ready to do what to somebody else? He. All right. She said, "Beat, beat, beat." All right, all right. <laughs> pause. <laughs> Wait, how you got to no pause, pause Leslie? No you got to pause, Leslie. That nigga ain't no awesome. Man, listen. <laughs> but no, nah, seriously, like uh, he's been going uh, crazy uh, and breaking so many people who don't like this boy album. Like you cannot force people man. like his yeah. album. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't agree. I don't. It's this gangster shit. Like I, I think, I think Drake fans, his initial fans are growing up, and he not, and that's just the fact of no, like. Say that he, one more time. Stuck in a, I said I, Drake, I think Drake initial fans, like when he came out, when we was all fans of Drake. I think we yeah. growing up, and he not. And I think is he's stuck in the box, man. And he gotta he gonna have to chill for a minute and come back with something, man. He gotta chill. That's why he he's taking. He, and he's he been putting out but, a lot of music but, over the last couple of years. I, I was gonna say though, but he came out with the one single like uh, some months back. What was that song? I can't even think of it. I played that song out like oh, fire. The one, the one where he had Kim voice in the uh, uh, search yeah, and yeah. Search, search and rescue. Search and rescue. Search, yeah, search, I, search I, and rescue. Like search and rescue. Like that was fire to me. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like so he he hit you with some. A lot of people like didn't like that song. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't like. I didn't like Search and Rescue. It grew on me, but when it initially no, came that's out, that's I didn't. That song was fire. Yeah, that's your opinion, but <laughs> like I said, nigga, when it came out, I didn't like the shit. You heard? You heard <laughs> the <laughs> Calm down, yeah, Birdman. We, we, we started this. We started this podcast, but I'm always right. So go ahead. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. I, 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 I love hey, Trey. Hey, 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 Blaze, mm-hmm. I appreciate you like always. Mm-hmm. It was a certified banger. That shit was hard. You heard what he said. And I agree. Mm-hmm. Well, you know what? I guess I guess I, I, I guess, guess I guess I guess I double teaming him now. I, I guess I, I, I guess I agree too, Leslie. It's, nah, it's, it's up to you. We disagreeing <laughs> now. Two and two. What y'all want to do? <laughs> Leslie, I'm, the only, nah. I'm the only doctor on the pod, so yeah. I think my vote should be right. right. <laughs> None of y'all got a PhD. I you think do. my vote should weigh heavier. Yeah, I, yeah, I just got a bachelor's. I just need to shut the fuck up. Um, he got a P- he got a PhD, and my mom got a master's, so I'm gonna take hers. All right, you're gonna. You're gonna t- <laughs> 
What is what is going on today, dog? I don't even know. What's going on. <laughs> but anyway, back to what I was saying though. But uh, um, but yeah, this 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 album, bro. Like I said, it just it just didn't resonate with me at all. I definitely felt like it was like this is for a younger intended audience. I guess it's, especially with the combination of me knowing that he worked with Yachty on this. You know what I'm saying? I, I felt like it was intentional the the sound, but it just it just didn't do much for me at all. You know what I mean? But it is what it is, man. I, like I said, I I, I do hope. Joe Button, I like okay. Uh, y'all don't y'all do know he's been beefing with Joe Button lately, uh, uh, behind his controversial take on the album, uh, which I didn't think was too controversial because everybody agreed with him. You know what I mean? And that and that was what I was going to ask. Why y'all. can't people have an opinion? That's what I was just about mad. to ask you. Like when, like I said, because we talked about truth telling earlier. Like when do does it come come into play? Excuse me, Jesus Christ. Uh, when does it come into play that? you telling the truth about an album isn't received as hate or you having an opinion about something isn't received as hate. Because people think that just because they like somebody, you're supposed to like them or just because they feel mm. like this person is the it person, everything they right. do is just so great. And that's not fair because I don't have to like some shit just because it's Drake. I don't give a damn who it is. If the shit is trash, it's fucking trash. Mm. And y'all can't make mm-hmm. me like it. Yeah, I think I think I, I think and because remember he uh, got on Charlemagne ass not too long ago for criticizing. Him. Yeah, he, he was he was too, the first one he attacked. I, he he just not used to critic. He not used to like it's that life negative shit. reactions right. to his music, man. Like he right right. Think think how long. Life I mean, at, at this point, would have been like almost twenty years. Like Drake been number one, number one, number one. Right. Good album, good album. Right. Critical acclaim, and like that shit started to get to him. You could tell. Yeah. So then step hey. your game up and make better music. Then yeah. I, 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 I mean, no, I, I, yeah. I don't, I don't think he. I, and th- and this is what I'm saying. Like I told y'all, I, I like Drake. I don't think he trying. He trying to make. He trying to be the old Drake, but that shit is. We don't want the old Drake. We want Evolution Drake. I don't even think he's trying to be the old Drake. I just feel like he don't. I, I don't feel like he's passionate about music no more. It, it feel like it feel like lazy song making. Mm-hmm. He, he Drake even when Drake sing, and that was my issue with. <laughs> Sir, Sir, hold on, wait, Trey. That was my issue with Search and Rescue. Even when Drake sing, it's not even the same damn key as it was when he was on. Uh, nothing was the same. It's not even the same. Drake at, at some point, I thought Drake could actually sing, and and over the last few albums, I'm like, this nigga can't sing. It's not in the good key at all. Hey, he going through. He going through his little wine. He going through. He going through his little wine. Yeah, yeah, hey, exactly. Remember, hey, remember, Trey, I think the drugs little, are starting to affect me. Hey, hey, remember when Little <laughs> Maybe it's the Wayne girls. hit that height? He hit that height to where like his fans was like anything he put out was just fire, and he mm-hmm. was saying some just awful, awful, awful lyrics. Like mm-hmm. he was horrible for like five, for like four to five years. Drake done hit that point where like no matter even his album is as much as people hate it. It's still gonna be platinum. It's still gonna be, you know what I'm saying? It's oh, gonna yeah, be it's, number it's, one. It's, it's, yeah, it's he, he don't, yeah. he don't, he don't reach it to where like he just giving you like, oh, let me go in here and throw this shit down. Like you said, he's not really caring about it because mm-hmm. Lil Wayne went like four or five years, but he didn't give a damn about no music. Mm-hmm. He was putting out bullshit. Yeah, but his man. fans was like, it was cold. I'm so high, yeah. I can sh- eat a star or some shit. Like, come on, fam, that's horrible. Yeah, it, it's, like, yeah, it, it's definitely making me appreciate Kendrick and Cole and the, and their frequency of dropping uh, a lot more than. Um, a lot more than uh, um, uh, Drake's because he's been dropping year after year after year multiple projects, and 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 like I said, it's all been watered down. Like every time Kendrick, for the for the most part, I won't say every time. J, uh, J Cole last album was incredible. All the stuff he's doing with Dreamville as a record label has been dope. Um, but it, it was a couple projects in there over the last like ten years that I really didn't care for. But um, but Kendrick, he ain't missed. He ain't, he ain't missed a beat, and, mm-hmm. and he and he drops very seldom. Um, um, and these are just the hot, the, the the goats we talking about right now. Of course, there's plenty of other artists that are pretty consistent when it comes to making music. Um, a, a lot of them that are that don't get that don't get half the credit, recognition. They have to one thousand percent. They don't get half the recognition. Um, Travis Scott being one of them. I feel like Travis Scott is he don't he don't miss either, but he don't drop at a high clip either. You know what I mean? But uh, but uh, um, my whole point being, uh, uh, I, I I I I need to see him take a break. To Joe, Joe said this on the show. He said he wouldn't mind him taking a, a two year break. I need to see him take a little bit longer than that. I wouldn't mind hearing from Drake for a while. Let somebody else get well, some of that. He said he's gonna take some time for himself right now. Yeah, he needs to. Maybe maybe a feature here and there. Yeah, maybe Pusha T really did right. take some of that 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 luster that shine off of Drake when when he dissed him. What, how do y'all feel about stop that? Because he, bro, man, he'll be a, bro. A, he, a, a stop it, bro. Listen, he, bro, dude, ain't addressed. He didn't address Rihanna yeah, and ASAP I mean, Rocky it, it on this been album. Downhill slide since then. That's what I'm he, saying, he was, bro. After the him and Meek shit, he was at a like a peak. 
I think that was the peak. Then after right. that pushing shit, it, it kind of it. I I ain't think about it like that, but it had been. And he ain't addressed. He was at a peak. He, he was at a peak music wise, but like he still was number one after that. Every he time still. He well, I'm talking about he dropped, if he so, dropped. So that, I'm talking about, I, bro. It's a machine behind Drake. I ain't. Ta- I'm them them numbers and shit. That's all political. I ain't getting into that number. I'm talking about the artistry. Yeah, not the artistry. Yeah, no. That's what I'm talking you know, about. I'm not talking. I can't. I can't fight that. That's what I'm talking about. I ain't talking about the numbers because we all know numbers can be manipulated. It's machines behind shit. It's in, it's interest and in, Drake is one. Man, of, Drake is like he'll Apple, be number bro. One just because he Drake, right? Right. Exactly. Drake is Drake is like Apple, bro. He too big to fail. Mm-hmm. So at some point, there's gonna be a machine that gets behind mm-hmm. him and continues to. You know what I'm saying? Like it's it, that's no, how that's how yeah. that's how shit work. It, like like you know what I mean? Like it's it. Drake got a lot of people on the payroll. It's a lot of people interest in Drake being the biggest artist in the world. Like you know what I mean, so it, it, but it, it, he's going to say. How are you going to come back? Um, <clears throat> how are you going to come back from somebody basically like exposing like your whole kid? Like that was like the that was like the lowest of the low to the blow. Like mm-hmm. we got to fight, or I'm going to have to shoot you. Like the, it was one of those. Tell, and, the, the, and, the it bothered because he's still shooting shots, right? And they, mm-hmm. it's, they subliminals, but they ain't nothing direct. But that's the whole issue. Like, you yeah. can tell. Like, light like, skin shit. Yeah. Here we go again with the light skin shit. Mm-hmm. He even tried to it have it. all boils down to him being a light skin ass nigga. Let, let, he even let, had let, to have, let, he, let, even, let, he, let, even, let, he even had, he even tried to have Jim Jones come after him. Like I don't like you bringing up the light skin shit because, you know, I'm fairly light skinned myself. Trey, you are okay. you are in color, but nigga. You are a dark nigga. nigga. Right. Uh, you know what? I'm, 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 I'm like, hey, hey, man. I'm a Drake bar. See? See how I did that? See how I did that? I just fucked your ego. See? Hey, 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 but what you saying is he just, he said it, but he ain't mean it. Mm-hmm. We said we're we gonna get Leslie. Lying in your lyrics. Lying in your lyrics. We're gonna get Leslie in the booth because she because she's spitting. Hey, hey, we ain't gonna start that place. Mm-hmm. No, I'm just asking. I'm asking. That was a question. Mm-hmm. But uh, uh, but to, but to my point, like I said, he even tried to have Jim Jones come after him and everything. Like I said, I, I feel like some of that shine was definitely taking off his artistry. I don't know. Like I said, if it, it hit, if it just hit him in a, a certain, a I, certain I never looked at it. I never looked at it like that. But you, yeah, I mean, it makes sense. Yeah, because like I said, he addressed I'm everybody on the time. This nigga was dissing Rihanna and ASAP. Like what? <laughs> like why are you even going there, fam? Like like, and if y'all don't know, y'all ain't real fans of hip hop because it's subliminals all through that shit. Like like, and that's like, childish. <laughs> like put a name on it. Right. Said what y'all said. Like skin. Mm-hmm. He, he did. <laughs> no, yeah. he didn't. He got to say the name. Not, <laughs> say not, say don't make me feel look, like you said you, it. Say you, the mm-hmm. name. Mm-hmm. You put a grandma. I am too, though. I am mm-hmm. too. Yeah. I am he too. out of order. Well, if y'all ain't got nothing. Leave that young girl yeah. alone. He just mad because she ain't want his ass. Light skin shit. See? Mm-hmm. Everything reverts back well, to let... light skin <laughs> shit. <laughs> Leslie, he said he said y'all keep acting like he ain't over her. So you can't do that to him. He said like he want her. He said better, better, better ASAP than him. <laughs> yeah, I bet. I bet. I bet. Right. If, if her ass uh, DM'd his ass right now, he'll be going mm-hmm. knocking them barrettes out his head to get up over there. Uh, so knocking them barrettes out of mm-hmm. <laughs> Taking all them barrettes out to get right up over there. All right. I see where this <laughs> is going. And he ain't going to stop and get him a honey pack on the way. <laughs> <laughs> well, <All right>. spe- <laughs> well. <laughs> Speaking of, uh, uh, well, let's let's ch- change gears here and talk about a good rapper, uh, J. Cole. J. Cole has been on a tear. Why do people keep adding him <laughs> to their feature list, fam? Why don't they just leave J. Cole alone? Hey, um, no. he 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 been on fire, man. The man been on on a, a streak like no other. Man, it, I remember it was a point I was getting this, I, this, I, this this verse on Yachty, man. This, this is crazy. That verse on Yachty was insane. The verse on the Drake album is insane though, too. Like yeah. like like. <clears throat> Oh, absolutely, bro! And I can't believe Drake did that shit next to him, bro. Like, just the, I feel like Drake was ad libbing that song. I don't even feel like he was in there like with the intents to actually. Yeah, I, I, me as a Drake fan, I'm I was you, man. very, I was very disappointed when I, I was like, I said, no, nah, you gotta, go, you gotta go insane on this with J Cole. Like, you just got to. Mm-hmm. I mean, and that's what did. you would expect. I, I yeah. Yeah, I, I was because I was because we done seen Drake show and prove though. Like he done when he when he's supposed to. Oh, bro, he's supposed to bar up. Yeah, bro. Anybody he rapping with, bro? But like, I was expecting him to go nuts. I played it like three times, so I'm like, maybe I missed it. <laughs> Do you guys think that it. Drake may have possibly back uh, when he was just just giving it to us raw? No pause. Um. <laughs> 
he maybe had like a like a ghostwriter and maybe mm-hmm. the ghostwriter got fired and now he's trying to do it on his own. So that's why he's a little well, off or tacky. Well, well, well no, nah, because he's still... Been he's still no, nah, but if you even think to like his last few albums, it'll be a, like he has songs where he go nuts. It's just the album is not good. You know what I'm saying? That's and, been like, that's one... That's one thing Kendall's always disliked about it. The like, purpose of like, dropping like, the album you know, is to play the shit from the beginning to the end he, he, with no skips. He, he, yeah, but but he trying right. to be on his he trying to be on his Kanye thing. Like like I'm an artist. Oh, not again, a you know what I'm saying? You're not answering yeah. my question. Do, do you believe that when he was giving us that, where you could play the whole album and we all going like going crazy in real life, not going crazy just because it's Drake, but we real life going no. crazy. No, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be real, but like, let, let me jump in because I'm, 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 I am a Drake fan. I'm really asking so, a serious so, question. So, so, I'm, like, I'm, I'm being I'm real serious be, right I'm, now. So I'm, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be real. I don't, th- I don't think so at all. Because okay. he done wrote, he, he's wrote verses for Lil Wayne because Lil Wayne just didn't want to do the shit. Like okay. Lil Wayne had to do a feature and li- literally, hey, Drizzy, I need you to write me a sixteen for this. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, so I like, think, like, I think, I think he used to have a chip yeah. on his shoulder, and now he, yeah, when you universally regarded as like the best or you feel like you should be regarded you, as the you best stop, maybe, you, maybe stop, you still ain't got that same motivation like I, you stop giving who a knows kind of, you know yeah. what I'm saying and, and then he like, I was, it and I was gonna say he's super sensitive so like hopefully everybody nice talking about this out everybody t- yeah everybody talking about this uh <laughs> album though Ho- okay. hopefully he get he get 40 about the bed like hey man we gotta go make another one <laughs> real right, quick right. or something you know what I mean like because he's sensitive so like People, went, I mean, like we don't heard people talk about albums. Like his album, we're like, oh, I don't like it. But some people like it. I have not seen one person say they like it. Uh, I think you might be right because I ain't seen no. I've been on Twitter the last couple of days. All kind of supposed to be seeing it, but yeah, yeah. But back, but back, so hopefully, he get, back, hopefully back, he get back in the uh, in the booth. Right, but back to Cole. 